EAA 304, Highway Engineering Laboratory. Ring and Ball Test. Welcome to Highway Engineering Laboratory. This video describes step by step procedures to determine softening point of asphalt binder. The softening point is determined through ring and ball test conducted using ASTM D36 standard test method for softening point of bitumen using ring and ball apparatus. Objective To determine the softening point and temperature susceptibilities of asphalt cement, the softening value can be used to evaluate the consistency of asphalt cement. The ring and ball test requires the following apparatus Ring and ball Ball centering guide Ring and ball support Hot plate Thermometer Beaker And stopwatch Bitumen is a viscous elastic material, which becomes softer and less viscous as the temperature rises. Therefore, the softening point must be determined to indicate at what temperature the binder gradually change, from semi-solid to liquid state when heated. The softening point is the mean temperature, when the bitumen sample soften and fall downwards a distance of 25 mm. At this point, the bitumen sample can no longer support the weight of a 3.5 gram steel ball. Softening point is indicative of the tendency of the material, to flow at elevated temperature encountered in service. Bitumen with higher softening point, may be preferred in warmer places. Procedure Prepare a set of specimens, by heating the asphalt binder in an oven until it's sufficiently fluid. Fill the rings with the sample. The excess asphalt binder, is cut in the surface as leveled using a hot scrapper. Fill the beaker with the distilled water, until the level of the water is 50 mm above the tops of the rings. Insert the ice cube to reduce the bath temperature to 5 degrees Celsius. Place the ring and ball support into the beaker. Leave the steel balls inside the beaker and set up the thermometer. Maintain the bath temperature at 5 degrees Celsius for 15 minutes. Using forceps, place a steel ball that has been cooled in temperature 5 degrees Celsius previously, on each of the ball centering guide. Place the beaker on top of hot plate. Heat the water, so that the temperature of the water rises at 5 plus minus 0.5 degrees Celsius per minute, for the first 3 minutes. Heat the water continuously, until the sample is sufficiently soft to allow the steel ball to fall through the ring. Record the temperatures, when the asphalt specimens surrounding the steel balls touch the base plate. If the difference between the two recorded temperatures, exceed 1 degree Celsius, repeat the test. Report the temperature to the nearest 0.5 degree Celsius, for both of specimens. Thank you for your time. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to contact us at sarg.usm2011 at gmail.com.